November 15th is the last day that you could submit your pictures for the tour. This is what it has come to, is a five hour ride for one tour stop before I go to work. We are in Sutherland Springs and this church right here is the one that um, was built after the previous church got shot up. Um, that sounded a little insensitive. The previous church got shot up. Um, and actually what happened was 26 people died during that shooting at the church in Sutherland Springs. One of them was an unborn child. So I did not mean for it to sound that insensitive. Um, I was just kind of in a rush when I hit record. So, oof. They built back better for sure. With donations and charity so anyways just thought, I, just thought I wanted to point that out to you one of my dad's favorite things to do when he was younger was he would come through these little towns like this and, and didn't he would buy up uh, older cars like that one that we just saw but you know are out here in these fields like this you know he'd just go knock on the door and say hey that uh, rust bucket you got out there was just thought to you know thought I'd See if you want to get rid of it. We are an hour out from the statue, an hour out from Popeye. Popeye. Okay, good, good, good. I was a little disappointed about this whole Elon Musk Twitter thing. Um, a lot of people know I'm kind of an Elon Musk fanboy. Hey, uh, that's me. I'm Jason. I'm an Elon Musk fanboy. Don't judge me. Um, and whenever he, whenever he said that he was going to buy twitter i was kind of like just indifferent you know what i mean i was like oh cool you know that's kind of cool you know whatever I, I will admit i went and got an account i opened up an account as soon as he made that news um but i, I made that for local talent my podcast not for anything else anyways um and then all these people all the all, all these employees are like i'm gonna quit if elon musk is gonna buy us out we're all gonna quit screw this guy we hate him boo right so oh hell here it comes anyways the twitter deal with elon musk i don't understand one everybody hates a guy he doesn't want him to buy it and then he tries to back out of the deal and they're like no screw you we're gonna make you buy us oh my god this is just crazy anyways rich people problems right so i got my buddy danny riding with me he gets, I don't know, gets, he said he gets about 150 miles of the tank. But so we're at about 110. <laughs> I know, I know what he's feeling right now. You're following somebody, y'all communicated about the mileage, you know. I don't think he probably rides this far without putting gas in his tank. <laughs> hey man, I feel you, I feel you. You ever rode with, with road cap, you, you're gonna have them feelings frequently. So like I saw him pull off, but I was like, it seemed like an awful way to go, awful, awful long way to go to turn around and come get up. There he is. Oh, good, 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 good. Take the next left. Uh, Take the next right. Your destination is on the right. Well, shit. We'll take a picture of his ass. I hope that's good enough for the tour. I'm not afraid. So my buddy Danny here, we were having lunch and uh, he's like, so what's this tour stop stuff all about? What's this all about? You know? So I told him, I was like, oh, well, you know, I'm on a grand tour of Texas and uh, you know, there's 50 stops and you got to ride your bike to all these places and take a picture of your flag and the, and the bike and the, and the stop. And he's like, cool. How many you got? So I showed him my map 
And then so he was scrolling around looking and he goes, hey, what's, what's up with this Quanta Parker out arrow in, in Seminole? I started to tell him the, the history of Quanta Parker, the last Comanche chief. He goes, oh no, I know who he is. I'm related to him. I was like, no shit. So we just got done talking for about, I don't know, an hour about how he's related to Quanta Parker. But hey, if something pops up into this old brain of mine, I'll share it with you. I'd like to see you do that with your current media mod. That's right. You can't. You can't do that. That's why you need the Setzer Pendants mod media mod. Just saying. What's up? Uh, do you, I know you still talk to that printing guy or whatever. Does he, uh, do you have the ability to get us stencils that say reserved and then like the numbers one through 10? Um, I'm not sure. I can find out. I'll let you know. Can we just please take a small moment, just a small smidge of a moment, to appreciate the quality of the audio coming out of my helmet and into your ears at this moment from a phone call that I got doing 80 on my motorcycle today and I was like we need to put reserves on here Jason was just bitching about that and he's like yeah well I don't know what happened to old Danny boy uh, I'm pretty sure he's okay I just don't do traffic very well it's tough I could never ride in a group in traffic much less in traffic come on come on haven't got all day Exchange Avenue for half a mile, then your destination will be on the right. You dumb girl, you dumb. Oh, got some bugs. Got some buggage. Man, you be bugging. What do I need? What do I need? Well, Cheerio. Maybe he went up to get lunch. Or he did not. Well, it's time to go to work. Nobody's looking for you. There's some accident on the other side of the goddamn highway. And all these fucking people are rubbernecking looking at over there. And they're not even paying attention to you. So this makes me the most nervous. Now that we're past all that. Now I feel a little bit more safe, even though I don't like being in this boxed in claustrophobic mess. But yeah, whenever there's a wreck, and you got a lot of rubbernecking, oh man, my freaking spidey senses go on full alert. I've got so much editing to do, it's not even funny. I see your titties. I see your titties.